I think, generally speaking, you know, we do look at you know the level of density of information, and I think we're very interested in you know how much divergence there is around the desire for a lot of information density versus something that is kind of less dense. But I think I think that I guess what I mean to say is like there's probably more that the world has in common around this than we are radically different, and I think that potentially it's also about allowing people different ways to communicate their own stories. Because for something like Facebook, you have to remember, you know, what they're experiencing primarily is not the chrome of what we've designed. It's the stories that people put in the container. Um, so, you know, it's, it's more about, you know, the content that they're engaging with and having that container kind of recede. And so sometimes it's about the creation tools that we provide to people, um, potentially being like a new kind of dimension of, of creativity. So, for example, on Instagram, you know, the filters that people use really changes the way that they express themselves creatively. I've, I haven't seen this, so it'd be really interesting to ask the Instagram team if there's a difference by market of which filters are being used, because I would expect there would be, actually. Um, and you, you get into kind of subtle differences of people wanting things to be kind of bright and visually engaging versus you know, potentially more clean.